since today is my birthday, I will be counting 27 things that I've learned in 27 years. So if I were you, I'd look out for number one and number 24. Let's do this. Hey everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. It is your girl Petty and it is... to the years that they are turning so i am turning 27 this year and i thought to myself i should um tell my my followers the 27 things that i learned in 27 years so yeah let's get into today's video my number one is give yourself to jesus it will save you a lot of energy if you have followed me on this channel you know my q a video where i shared to you how i received christ and like I said, I've always been a Christian, but in 2017, I fully surrendered my life to Jesus Christ. And it is the best thing that I've ever done. So give yourself to Jesus. It will save you a lot of energy. You know that you have someone you can share everything with. And this person is not a person, but a super being is bigger than the world, than everything that we go through. He will take care of you. So give your life to Jesus and it will save you a lot of energy my number two is you cannot always win and that's okay so by saying this i'm saying for me i'm a fixer anything that's wrong i want to try to fix it you you know i want to make it we make it work i want to win i want to come out victorious but sometimes it is accepting the fact that you know this is not going to work like this time i failed and that's okay so you cannot always win and that's okay my next point is no matter how much you try you cannot make everyone happy and that's okay even if you're a good person even if you give money to the whole world even if you do amazing things you are a person who who give herself to people someone is not going to be happy someone is always going to complain like okay she gave me small she didn't give me enough or that was favor she gave someone more someone is not going to be happy no matter how much you try to be nice i think that's one of the points that i learned and it was a painful realization that i am a good person as petty i'm trying to help people i'm doing all the amazing things that i can do but then there is still someone who is still not going to be happy and for me i had to accept to say you know what that's okay so yeah that's my next point number four is you have what it takes to become whoever you want to become it is inside of you who to become a doctor a nurse a creative a president it is really inside of you I think over the years I have learned to really tap into my talents and just to discover more about myself and whatever I discovered I was really mesmerized to be like wow is this petty like is this petty who can actually go to YouTube create content is this petty who can give um, who can do this for the ladies I work at hold your hand with the ladies or who can share this I was blown away by how much I can um, do in my life so you have what it takes inside of you to become whoever you want to become just discover it you know just discover it the next point is just be nice just be nice you don't know who the person you're talking to is who is gonna become tomorrow or five years later you don't know so just be nice to everyone you meet in the streets when you're eating your lunch at work just be nice the next person that probably you're going to um, argue with or say nasty nasty stuff too probably is going to be the one giving you a job tomorrow 
or opening a door for you so just be nice and the next lesson is research learn 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 i i think now you now know me because i'm always bringing up the research the learning part it is because you can never learn enough there's no there's no way that you can actually wake up and say i now know enough no you have to research you have to learn read books listen to podcasts read your bible um listen like go to events listen to someone talking it's not always about you sometimes listen to what the other person is saying so that you learn so always always be open to learning learn as much as you can lesson number seven is it's okay to fall but don't remain there it's okay that today you woke up and then you mess up and then you fall but then don't stay there always pick yourself up dust that dust off and keep it pushing all today you failed your exam pick yourself up dust that dust off and keep it pushing or maybe you failed you missed an opportunity it's okay it's it really is okay so it's okay to fall pick yourself back up and keep it pushing the next number eight is in the end things will always work out it also gives into the point that i said previously about falling there's something about i don't know how it happens that in the end you finally discover ah, it's the end of the year that time when i lost money or that time when a b c d this bad thing happened in the end you're like but then I moved on and actually things got better so in the end things will always work out and so don't give up or don't throw in the towel just know that in the end it will eventually work out number nine is you were never meant to fit in you were born to stand out I think for me growing up I really wanted to fit in I wanted to belong somewhere to a group I think that's just who I, we are as humans we want to be associated with other people with certain characters especially the cool characters but then as you grow up for me once I started living in my purpose I realized that I could no longer fit in and it's, it's something that really ate me for a long time to be like okay I'm doing great things but still with the other people i'm failing to fit in what is the problem so that is why i want to say you were never meant to fit in you are born to stand out there are just at some other people that must be that must stand out that must lead other people and it's okay to not fit in so that's my point and then number 10 is just show up wake up and show up I sometimes there are moments when I come here or I know that I have to release a YouTube video but then I'm just like I'm not in the mood or like today it was raining I was like there is no way that I will record a video then the reason why I say that is because when the rain is falling it makes noise on the roof and I cannot record like you cannot hear me properly but then just wake up bath and show up sometimes that's all you have to do you just have to show up you don't know what you will miss if you don't go or you will miss if you don't show up show up no matter if you have pain in your body if you things are not going according to plan just show up that's my point lesson number 11 is just be who you are there are people that are waiting to embrace you a community that is willing to embrace you as you who you are the moment that we try to be other people like i said in the fitting in part where i'm saying you were never meant to fit in is it delays us to find the people that are looking for us that wants to embrace who we are personally so just be who you are and there are people that out there that will embrace you as you know the we which some may call weird the weird party or the shy party or the content the contented party so 
yeah just be who you are authentic just be authentically who you are and someone or other people that are looking for you will find you my point number 12 i think it's number 12 is identify your red flags identify your red flags and fix them you are not perfect you will continue to not be perfect as long as you are a human being so identify those red flags to say oh i think i've got pride let me fix that or i know that i've got a pride i have to fix that you know it's something identify your red flags or i don't you i'm not honest i need to fix that so identify the red flags that are inside your life and try and fix them fix them and it's okay even to ask god to be like i'm struggling with a b c d help me so identify your red flags and fix them my next point is it's okay to ask for help you don't have it all figured it out you really really don't and there is someone who has it better than you who is better than you at something so it's okay to always be willing and open to ask for help drop your pride drop your ego and say okay can you please help me with abcd it will save you a lot of energy it will save you a lot of time something that was supposed to take two days can take an hour so it's okay to ask for help number 14 is don't limit yourself don't ever limit yourself be willing to discover your capabilities for me I, to tell the truth i had no idea that i'll be here today i'm in love with content creation i'm helping girls i studied i studied business management and i thought maybe i'll be working at a company doing a b c d but now that i am here i've realized that i have so much i always say that i see myself as the man with many talents in the bible who was given five talents by god and was like and then when Jesus came back, he, he presented five more talents. So I always want to say that I want to present more talents when I get to heaven. So don't limit yourself. Discover more about yourself. Discover if you're a musician, a songwriter, if you are good at content creation, if you are good at a certain thing, go deeper. Discover your passions. Discover everything. Make sure by the end of the journey, when you finally leave this earth and go to heaven you're able to say man i have lived i have given everything i have touched everything about me that i i i wanted to touch oh that was inside of me so yeah don't limit yourself the next point is never give up never 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 give up this is self-explanatory whatever you're doing don't give up keep pushing keep grinding keep working Yes, and one day, one day is one day, it will finally pay off. So don't give up, never give up. Number 15 is, every storm runs out of rain. I think it's a Maya Angelou quote, which says every storm runs out of rain. There is also something that I discovered in life that things may seem so bad, but there's always light at the end of the tunnel. One day things will make sense. Like I said before, um, in one of my points that you would discover that things will always work out and if you're going through something today you know one day it will uh, the storm will finally cease and the sun will start to shine again and my number 17 is even if you are busy find time for friends and family i think this is something that i'm still trying to work on i am such a busy person but um now as i am moving forward i'm thinking of becoming more family friends oriented because even if you're busy you still need a community we still live in a global village and you still need people you still need relations so cherish your friends and your family my next point is guard your heart i think it's a verse in proverbs and i've shared it on my podcast it's a verse in proverbs which says guard your heart because life flows from it everything starts from the heart everything starts from the heart 
so always protect your heart from people from words from you know a lot of things just happen in this life that you should always preserve your heart keep it clean because this is where life will flow especially for us who are leaders who are doing something in the community this is where we this it all starts with the heart we help people from the heart so guard it for life flows from it the next point is i'm not forgetting the next point let me just check now forgetting the next point oh share what you have with others so share what you have with others if it's knowledge if it's talent share it with other people you know share it with um be willing be be a giver be a giver there is another verse which says keep on casting your bread upon the water for it will come back again meaning keep on the what when you are giving you're actually throwing blessings and it will come back to you double tripled quadrupled if there is a word like that so keep on casting your bread upon the water give and by giving i'm not talking about money i'm talking about even knowledge even talent even just as little as just you know sharing something something with someone like uh i want to share this a b c d with you a word just to encourage them so keep on casting your bread upon the water if you have money cash or kind it's even it's okay so give be willing to share be willing to give number 20 support other people show up for other people support other people even if it means like liking on social media um commenting sharing a post just support other people show up for other people even at their events even at their weddings or things like that show up for other people my next point is enjoy every moment i think it's point number 21 enjoy every moment in whatever you're doing if you are plating hair if you work in the saloon if you are you work in the office enjoy whatever you are doing be in the moment feel it and you will find so much like you, it will be easier for you so enjoy every moment i remember when i was in high school i was a sports person and i would enjoy every moment like i would enjoy even now um recording this video i am enjoying every moment so take every moment and enjoy it the next point is remember to take a break so my work that i do it requires so much from me mentally physically and i've learned to take breaks there are days when i don't work i'll be playing and then there are days that i work like today I've been working since morning <laughs> so remember to take breaks you are not a machine you are not a robot so take breaks when you need them number 24 is 23 make Jesus your best friend by saying make Jesus your best friend I am saying tell him everything tell him everything if you are afraid if you have messed up if you're happy if you're sad everything you tell him the details okay god this is what happened today a b c d and i need your help at a b c d i am grateful at a b c d tell him be open with him at everything make jesus your best friend number 24 is my favorite number 24 is my favorite <laughs> don't give up on love I think as um, as people that are ambitious, sometimes we're just like, ah, I'm gonna have to love has to wait. I have to first buy my my house, buy a car, do A B C D. But that is not how it is. Like in the Bible, even it says it was not good for a man to be alone. I know that for us women, like it was for men. But even for us, it's not okay for us to be alone. We should have a companion a partner so don't give up on love never give up on love it even if you've been through 
let me just say through a bad relationship always pick yourself back up heal and be open to love again so never give up on love number 25 is give everything your all when you're doing everything make sure that you put your soul your mind your everything into it that is why i said in my other point take remember to take a break take a break but when you're back at work give everything your all so put everything your soul your mind and you know that when you do that there is a level of perfection and quality that comes out so give everything your own number 26 is patience pays <laughs> patience pays i know how hard it is for us sometimes to be patient but patience really do pays sometimes we pray for things and then we're like we want it right now lord but then when it now we keep on like standing on the word of god five years later those testimonies will come and you're like man it's good that i waited i didn't give up i waited on god or even in life in general when we are we want something sometimes it's okay to be patient and eventually patience really do pay so don't make decisions best because don't make like instant decisions because you failed to be patient number 26 is 27 okay number 27 the last and final point is you can do this you can do this i think there was years back then when this was my theme i can do this let's do this i always put it on my social media because that is what i think it's like three four years back you really can do this there is nothing that you can do if you put your mind your soul your everything in you can really do this so yeah those are the 27 things that i've learned in 27 years happy 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 i wish there was a song nights of Potter song or someone like that that i can just put here and dance or let me just put a little bit here <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,